a discounted life as a child of God. You see, all these things you are seeing around us today, most of all these young, young, and all of these, you know, cars, you know, houses, and all of that from this young, young, and all of that, I don't have problem with that. But if your means and source of getting it is not directly from God, you are living what? A discounted life. Look at Gehazi, another man who lived a discounted life. When Naaman came with his sickness to see the man of God, Elisha, the Bible said Elisha saw him from afar and he sent Gehazi to him and said, go tell that man to go to Jordan and dip himself seven times and he'll be clean. Although Naaman was very furious and said he didn't even come out to pray for me, he didn't even come out to talk to me, how can he just be sending that word and all of that? But that is not the area we are heading to. But after he went and he got his healing, the Bible says Naaman came with so many goods, cows, cattle, and what have you. And as he was still coming to appreciate the man of God, Elijah saw him and he also sent Gehazi and said, go tell that man, I don't need those things. Gehazi said, huh? And he went there. Hey! My Lord, my Lord, my Lord, my Lord. My spiritual father says he doesn't need any of those things. That's where he appreciates them, but you are free to go, 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 go. And he said, ah, look at cows. Look at Kame. Look at, he said, yes, he, he doesn't need them. And the Bible said, Nehemiah went and left with those things. Not knowing that Gehazi had another mission, he went through the back after delivering to the man of God and said, I'll deliver your mercy. He went through the back and ran after Nehemiah. Hello, sir, please wait, 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 wait. And then man looked back and said, Yes, as your master changes mind, they said, No, he doesn't need it, but for me, I need them. And then man said, Well, if you need them, make your choice. He said, I need this one. He said, Collect, I need this one. I need this one. I need this one. I need this one. And the Bible said, He collected all these things and went and hid them at the back of the house. And when he came back, Elijah said, where are you coming from? He said, uh, yes, actually, you see, I, 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 I went to do this, I went to do that. He just looked at him and laughed. You cannot hide it from who? God. Elijah told him, I said, as long as you have defied the instructions of the Almighty God, the sickness of Naaman shall fall upon you and your generation. There are accursed things you bring to the house as a man, as a woman, as a child. There are things you bring to the house that God might not be pleased with you. And that thing can bring damnations and destructions upon your life, upon your hope. Gehazi lived a discounted life. 